Merry meet everyone. This is Pushti Shiv Shakti from Goddess Breath and I'm here to give you your weekend reading. And without much ado, it's wattle and it says laughter. The message is uplift yourself and those around you through loving laughter. <sighs> At first sight, it's about just laugh, 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 enjoy yourself and have a great time. Which of course the message is that, you know, if you're going to have a party this weekend, which people normally do, it's going to be fun, it's going to be amazing, it's, uh, you're going to have a great weekend basically. Just remember to enjoy yourself, go out of your way to enjoy yourself, but an enjoyment that is fun, that is not hurting someone else, that is about, um, um, you know, that, that's about just a lot of joy. It's just a lot of joy in your life, be joyful, be happy and don't worry about how it feels to someone else when you try and share your joy because no matter what they will feel that joy they may resist it at first but they will feel it if you come from joy that joy is going to spread and you're going to you know you're going to create ripples and ripples of more joy right um, but it's also asking me or rather telling me to uh, share something with you guys do you realize how difficult it is for people to experience joy how difficult it is for people to just realize that it's okay to laugh. Some people, they are told to, um, you know, control themselves and they're laughing too much. There are people like me who always want to laugh in the wrong situations at the wrong time, which is just a stroke of brilliance. And I know how funny it is or how weird it is when everyone's really serious and you're in the corner going... Well, oh, that happens too. Well, so if there are others out there, I'm glad to know I'm not alone. But really, does it matter how you're, you know, how you're received? Does it really matter? Yes, it does. Sometimes, you know, you can't be, you know, you can't be laughing when mom's yelling at you, you know, or you're supposed to tell someone who's younger than you, like a subordinate or uh, your, your children, that this is not right. You will behave yourself. And actually in your head, you're laughing. That, that's happened to me. Not my children, but my students, you know, when I'm kind of trying to teach them something and I'm getting a little angry and then I'm laughing in my own head. But I've realized one thing that, you know, I can't keep my laughter in. My laughter is like boiling water. It bubbles, bubbles, bubbles and then it flows over, you know, it just flows over. And it is such joy to allow it to flow over. And I know all of us have that, that, that spring of laughter and joy within us, which is what we need to allow to express itself. This time, you need to be careful about how the people around you are enjoying and receiving your laughter. You don't have to change it. Maybe you can change the way you share it, right? The idea here is to have as many people laughing and as many people happy and joyful as you can. It's about knowing that just a, a bit of laughter can change someone's day. And one person's day changed can be, again, a ripple effect of many people's days changing. Can you do that for yourself? Will you have this weekend a laughter weekend? Will you give this weekend the laughter, the joy that you have in your heart? And continue to do so if you will, after the weekend. But this weekend is joy, is laughter, is fun and is light. It's, it's, um, it's light and it's, it's bubbly and it's frolicking and it's also um, it's also really uh, elated time, you know, it's a little elated time. It's also very beautiful to open your throat chakra because laughter opens your throat chakra as well. And it opens your heart. It opens your heart as well. So enjoy laughter this weekend and tell me how you felt and tell me how much you laughed and how much you made people laugh. I'm waiting. I'm looking forward to hearing from you. I'm sorry, I got distracted by that. So I am looking forward to hearing from you. Lots of love. See you on Monday.